welcome back. Today we're going to do the front lip on the Legacy GT. Um, as you can see, there's nothing down here as of right now. It's all scratched up. It's been hit a couple times. So give it a little different look. I figured I'd order this lip here off eBay. I'll, I'll show you guys what I got. This is the 05 to 07 US spec uh, bumper only. So, um, you know, we're, we're in the US. Uh, you make sure to get the US spec because um, there's most of them are the JDM style. This lip runs about $110, the eBay special. Although it does seem to be pretty good quality, um, it already has the holes drilled and it does come with all the tabs and fasteners. Um, so let's do a little test fit here and see how it lines up. Kind of gives you a rough idea here of, of how it's gonna look. It definitely adds a lot more definition to the front bumper and I think it makes it look a lot more aggressive. Now the lip did come with the eight supplied fasteners here and uh, about 16 screws. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use all of these quite yet, but we'll, uh, we'll get it lined up on the car and then we'll, we'll take a look. So just finished the install. It was a lot simpler than I thought. All of the holes in the lip were already drilled and everything lined up perfectly. As you can see, it's a real nice fit, no gaps. Uh, really pleased with how it turned out. It's kind of like a OEM plus is what I would say. Um, kind of a little bit of a gloss, but not too shiny. And it just seems to fit perfectly. So I'm really happy about it. Only took me about 10 minutes, just popped in all the tabs. And then I ended up using all the screws under here too. Um, one thing to note might make it a little easier is if you pre-drill um, before you do the screws. I did not do that because I'm lazy, <laughs> but I think it turned out amazing. So there's screws and fasteners. Screws and fasteners, yep. Okay, so it looks like there's what, three fasteners, four fasteners on each side, yep. and then it goes to screws where the front of the lip is. And then the uh, fasteners are on the other side. So yeah, very simple install. And I'm definitely happy with it for 110 bucks. I mean, you can't beat this. This is just real nice. We got it back down on the ground and I am very pleased with how it looks. I think it looks like a, a different car. I mean, it doesn't even look the same whatsoever. It's a great fitment. And I don't think it'll brush up on curbs too much as long as I'm careful. But definitely makes it look a lot sportier and a lot lower.